faith doesn't do any good just to have faith until you turn your faith loose. It doesn't do any good to have power unless you turn power loose. It doesn't do any good to have love unless you turn love loose. So whatever it is that we have has no power, it has no efficacy for us until we actually turn it loose. If you think you love somebody, you don't know whether you love them until you can turn them loose. And there's a liberating power in just being able to turn whatever you have loose and it begins to work uh, a tremendous work. Money doesn't do you any good to have money. Money can only do you good when you turn it loose. And so whatever it is, if you've got a need and then if you've got money and then you keep bragging that folks, I've got money, but you've got a need, until you turn that money loose and exchange it for the thing that you have the need over, then you'll never be blessed just because you have money. There are people that have it and are miserable with it. And there are people that have power, but they don't know how to use it. And absolute power corrupts absolutely. And so we have to give it away. Life is designed that from the time that you're born to the time that you die, you're producing stuff that God intended for you to give away. Isn't it interesting how God could gift you as a person? He put gifts and talents and abilities on the inside of you. And you know, your life can be such an incredible blessing to somebody else. And then you'd be sitting at home by yourself in your bed, curled up, sucking your thumb, <laughs> crying yourself to sleep. Uh, and you're gifted and you've blessed other people and made other people feel good. And then now you are sitting there in the fetal position you gifted. You've given other people words of encouragement and now you sit at home discourage yourself. Isn't it amazing how what God gave us is not really designed for us. It's designed to flow from us, but it's not designed for us. And so that in turn means that whatever God has designed for us, he's actually placed it in someone else. And we don't become fulfilled until that other entity then releases from them what they have for us.